I'll, I'll toss a few ideas around. Yeah. Talk to my manager. Is that me? Yes, that's you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, oh wait, no, I just cut you yeah, in at ten percent now. <laughs> Fuck! Why did I say that? It's on the it's on the record here. This it's on YouTube. There's I can't take it back now. Official. I can't. Hey man. Hey man, what's up? Check out these waps. These are some cool waps. Uh, these are Winston mods, as you can tell. What, what are you doing? Why are you just busting up the chainsaw? He's so excited. I accidentally <laughs> scrolled my mouse wheel. I just need to rev something right now. Alright, well, I'm not uh, chainsawing these vehicles. No. Let's see what we got. Oh. Oh, I like these interiors. You're, you're a ghost man? No, okay, wait. I was looking at the wrong one. My ghost man? Nah, I look normal. You're normal, dude. Just an everyday normal guy driving an everyday normal car. This interior is nice! It is nice. Aw, oh, shit. I immediately got stuck on my side. Oh, 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 oh it landed. shit. These things are fast. This thing's really wild for a freaking station wagon. Yeah, Let's get some high seriously. beams. Oh, okay. That's not that bad. Let me try my high beams. I'm getting nothing. Oh, okay. I see. Oh, shit. Oh god, this camera's so disorienting for me. Uh, yeah, this is the guy that has the shallow field of view camera. Shit. Damn it, I got stuck in the goddamn pen over here. Oh my god, here comes the ramp. I got my high beams and my regular beams on, too. Can't wait. Oh man, I just did like a... Oh. Oh, you went to a different ramp? Okay, okay. My game freaked out. I did like a barrel roll in the air, and then my game froze, and then I woke up in a ditch. Oh wow! Yeah, cool. My car's flipped over perfectly. Yeah, I'm gonna buy more station wagons because I already disabled mine. These guys are very flippable. Yep, they're flipping flippable, man. <laughs> I didn't notice that the <laughs> the station wagon's called Country Squire. Ah, you're my Country Squire. Thank you. You're a little. You're my little Podrick. Oh man, you're it's my... a heavy own. Yeah, and I'm Agatha Christie. Shit. Yeah. Get me my stew Podrick. <laughs> <laughs> Why's that making me laugh? Because it's the worst possible impression. That is pretty bad, yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, that's, the, that's something anyone would say. Uh, get me my stew Podrick. <laughs> People eat stew, man. Stew's a popular food. Not in old-timey Game of Thrones times. Yeah, they love stew. Yeah, I guess they. Holy stew. shit, this thing really takes off. Yeah, I know it's fast. It seems to like suddenly pick up speed at the top of the ramp, though. I'm trying to flip mine back over, but I think I'm just and gonna give up. I'm disabled. Yeah, they seem to handle basically the same. You can try the uh, the other car that we got here. The one Skidsville as well. Uh, kinda. It's it seems more lifted, but I don't know if that actually makes a difference. Let's see. Oh, I like the engine sound on the other one though. Yeah. That's a real good engine sound. I agree. It's beefy. It is beefy. Alright, I'm gonna hit this ramp proper. Here we go. Huh. Yeah, this wasn't that great, actually. Fetch me my diapers, Podrick. <laughs> <laughs> I like to enjoy a stew. <laughs> the stew has made my stomach rumble. Fetch me <laughs> my diapers, Podrick. Evacuate the bowel time. It is. Okay. Bury this, Podrick. It is my bury soiled this? diaper. <laughs> no, he has to bury the turds raw. Oh, yeah. Pluck from mine diaper the turds and bury them, <laughs> Podrick. Retrieve from me the turds three. <laughs> oh, man. Is that the wizard's, uh, wizard's riddle? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Retrieve from me these turds three. He mentioned three turds. I see only two. <laughs> the third uh, turd is you, young man. Oh, shit, I got owned by a wizard. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like one of those erotic books on Amazon. Have you ever seen those? Yes, yeah. The really specific fetish books. Like, yeah. Oh, no, I got owned by a wizard for people who like being uh, demeaned specifically by wizards. I can't tell how many of them are, like, specific fetish sexual things and how many of mm -hmm. them are, like, straight-up jokes. 
I mean, I don't know if anybody would bother to write even like a really short book as a joke. I don't know. I think there's a market of people that would buy it to be like, oh, look what I bought, and then never actually read it. I guess that's true. I, I, Cause there, there were times I was like, oh, this would be a good gag gift. But then it's like, you see how many of them there are? And it just loses its luster. Yeah, it's not even a special thing. It's a yeah. booming industry. It really is. I wonder how much money I could make as a, a, a niche eroticism author. You know what? I was just about to suggest that you write one. What should my angle be? Should it be, should it be, oh no, I got owned by a wizard? Yes. <laughs> it should be, uh, the wizard and his squire. It could be a gay eroticism thing. Okay. Um, and the wizard uses magical spells to trick his squire into having, uh, raw dog sex with him. <laughs> he, he, so he uses spells to trick him instead of just fully controlling him and making him do it. Yeah, okay, here's what you should do. He still likes the chase. I feel like, I feel like this is actually probably someone's fetish. Okay. The wizard makes a spell to make himself look like a sexy lady, and yeah. then has sex with the squire, and then he's like, Oh, you fool, it was I all along! <laughs> Twas mine, cornhole, thou ploweth! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you should actually write this. That's great. I'm getting a little excited. Not, not, not sexually, but... Uh, <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, creatively, creatively, I feel like... There's a lot of places I could go with this concept. Oh man, you're stiff of mind and of rock. Hey, uh, you're really roboting. Is there demand being placed on your side? Uh, no. Oh, you're fine now. You're fine now. Yeah, it's kind of it's fine, running fine. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, write your sexy boy book. I will write my sexy boy book. You could uh, sell it on Kindle. Oh yeah, I could. I mean, nobody, nobody ever actually like publishes those. You can self-publish them. No, I mean like no, but, but I mean like no one's printing off copies. They're always Kindle. Yeah, exactly. So all you gotta do is write it, self-publish it. You'll probably sell at least like ten copies. Sell them for four bucks a piece. That's forty bucks. Hmm. Hmm. What if I suddenly had a huge hit on my hands? Well, then you found yourself an amazing career. Yeah, I guess you're right. There's no, there's no what if. There's just, that's it. That's uh, that's your life now. Of writing erotic wizard trickery porn seize, literature. Seize the market, yeah. And that would be fun, though. That'd mm. be pretty fun. Little, uh, goo How long do those things have to be? I don't know. I guess I got to do some research, see what the average is. I bet they're probably pretty short. I bet they're like under 100 pages. Yeah, you probably bang that out in a day. Probably, yeah. Bang something out during that day, too, I bet, you freak. Uh, I'm not into that. <laughs> Don't you put fetishes in my mouth. <laughs> oh, man. He, also, you gotta make sure you describe what the, the wizard actually looks like in great detail. Uh, should he be wizened, or should he be handsome? No, he should be an old man with a long, gray beard. So, oh, like, a, just a classic wizard? Classic Merlin. He should classic, be Merlin. Classic, classic wizard style or Merlin style wizard. He should just straight up be Merlin. Yeah. Yeah. Is he is he public domain? Smirch the good name of Merlin. <laughs> if he's public domain, I'll do it. He's gotta be. I don't think. Uh, what would he even be from? Like, what creative work would he be from originally? The the legends of Camelot. I don't know. Is he part of that Arthur? King Arthur shit. He's 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 Arthurian for sure. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, that's old as fuck, so it's probably public domain. Most likely. I mean, you never know. If somebody, uh, I think it, it's after a certain amount of time, it will go public domain unless somebody buys up the rights again. Right. So if somebody's been juggling that ball for this all this time, who knows? I'm gonna Google that right now. Please. You go ahead and do whatever you want. I'm gonna Google. Just save me some research time. Is Merlin public? Domain. Well, that was the very first suggestion, so. Wow. People have been looking for this. Can I make a book of Merlin plowing his squire? Uh, first of all, wizards don't have squires. Let's get that straight. Good news. Hmm. Merlin legend, uh, the Merlin of legend, of the Arthurian legend, has uh -huh. an entry on the public domain superheroes wiki. <laughs> so, looking He's good. He's a superhero. Looking good. All right. All right. Go for it, man. All right, uh, yeah, just uh, keep checking your local Amazon webpage, folks. Oh, what's your pen name going to be? You have to have a sexy pen name. Oh, you're right. Shit. Drake Nightingale. 
Oh, that's pretty good. I was gonna go Blake. Oh, Blake Nightingale. That's good too. There we go. Mm. Drake seems to lend itself more to, to fantasy. Also, Drake the Rapper ruined it. Oh, yeah, you know what? Forget that then. Okay. Blake, Blake what? Blake Nightingale. Nightingale, okay. Uh, or Blake Fancy Feast. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll toss a few ideas around. Yeah. Talk to my manager. Is that me? Yes, that's you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, oh, wait, no, I just cut you yeah, in at 10%. 10 now. <laughs> Fuck, why did I say Sick. that? It's on, the, it's on the record here. It's on YouTube. There's I can't take it back it's now. Official. I can't, can't renege. Binding legal contract. Shit. So should I should the the sequel be the Squire's Revenge, where the Squire learns spells yes. and turns himself into a sexy lady? Yep, yep. But then, at the end, you find out that so he turns himself into a sexy lady to have sex with Merlin. <laughs> but then he finds out that Merlin actually made someone else look like Merlin with another spell. Oh shit! So okay, he that's got pretty twice good. Twice owned. That's like Inception style shit. Yeah. Um. That, 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 I just realized that the idea of somebody getting revenge on somebody by tricking them into cornholing them <laughs> is really funny. It's also really funny. Aha, <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, you've been cornholing me this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> but Squire, like, I, I, don't, I don't understand how that's, that's payback for me at all. That's just awesome for me. <laughs> Shit, I've self-outed. You gotta write this, man. This oh man, this be, all sounds great. It's gonna be the great American novel. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it always was gonna have Merlin in it, so. Perfect. Cool. All right. Well, thank you for, uh, uh, you know, coming up with this erotic concept <laughs> with me. Yeah, I can't uh, wait to see it on uh, my Kindle. Yeah, uh, look for it in one month's time because that's about how long it'll take. Brilliant, mate. <laughs> <laughs>